to believe that it could go walking by like at night, a mermaid would get you. The Mermaid, Lake of the Dead, from 2018, dives deep into the depths of Russian folklore horror, and at times made just her viewers gasping for breath, or some well-delivered moments to make the movie more than worth dipping a toe into to test its chilly waters. Russian director Sivotsolev Podjevsky brings together old Russian lore of a ghostly and vengeful female water wraith, who drags her victims deep under the water of a shoreside residence lake, with a contemporary tale of two young, soon-to-be-married lovers, in a tale that passes down its curse from father to son. The succubus creature draws off human love and attracts her victim, draining their life essence and calling upon them to choose between her intoxicating desires or human love. The price to pay is a life, dragging a victim to a watery grave unless you give up your most treasured thing in exchange. Roma's father's life was saved by his adoring wife, Roma's mother, giving up her life to the wraith of the lake in exchange for sparing her husband. Roma's father has relived that moment in despair ever since, but now his son Roma is to marry his young love Marina, and the family lakeside home is bequeathed to him. Roma and Marina visit the idyllic seeming homestead, and one night Roma is drawn to the moonlit lake dock, where a ghostly vision surprises him. His life is soon hook, line and sinker caught up on a horror hook as the mermaid lures him in to her world and her lake of the dead. Holy hair raising up the back of the neck chills are multiplying this is near Greece frightening stuff, an Olivia neutron bomb of modern horror and gothic chills combine as the wraith spirit of the lake proceeds to chillingly ask of Roma, do you love me? Well, hell on high water, baby. If this were Ash Williams' story, he'd be slapping his boomstick by now and giving this demon bitch some sugar slap to coat her decaying dentures, gummy bear, evil, dead red, groovy style. Poor young couple Roma and Marina are pulled apart by the ghostly entity as its apparition pops up to great jump scare effects all over the place. Time for Roma's sister Olga and their father to play a part as before his wife was taken, Roma's mother had apparently discovered something to stop the malignant mermaid. A hand-crafted comb ever used to comb the long flowing hair of the human-formed creature of nightmares may just be the brush with luck they are seeking. Time for the cursed Roma and Marina to face up to the mermaid on her turf and their rightful home, the house at the lake to uncover the truth. Slap yourselves giddy and invest your time in the mermaid and you too most likely will be rewarded well enough with a 5.5 out of 10 viewing experience from this fantasy horror drama that delivers older style creaky chills with some good practical effects and some pretty well delivered occasional CGI mixed in as well. 
with a choice to watch this movie with an English dub or original Russian language with English subtitles. There's more good than bad here for sure. The horror cuts cold to the core. If you dare to dive on in to this lake of the dead. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Okay. Oh,